Hey guys, and welcome back to Dust. So let's get into it. So we finally arrived at the village, and apparently, sheets going down. Let's see what we need. a quest. Okay, a quest. Why, hello there. I'm always thrilled to see a new face, even when it's all covered up like yours. Indeed. Well, my name is Dust, and this is Fidget. Hiya! Don't mind Mr. Grumpy. He's not big on the whole eye contact thing. Fidget and Dust, eh? Not from around here, are you? Well, neither was I originally. But this is a nice little place, if you're not in a hurry. Oh, where are my manners? I'm Augustine, local strongman. Say, you want to arm wrestle? Uh, some other time, perhaps. We're just passing through. Oh, that's a shame. Thought you looked like the arm wrestling type. You know, I heard what you did back there for Oneida. Great stuff. Maybe we can help each other out? Maybe. What did you have in mind? I have an old friend. A blacksmith. Lives way up at the top of Archer's Pass. I promised I'd deliver some materials to him way back when, but haven't been up that way in ages. Area's pretty dangerous these days, if you ask me. Maybe you could deliver them for me tell you what if you help me out i'll give you this blueprint if you give it to him along with these spare materials he'll set you on your way right quick a blacksmith that can craft items from blueprints i think i'll take you up on that augustine wow that's great i knew i could count on you when you see him just tell him that old augustine <laughs> says hello okay we finally found a blacksmith well we haven't found a blacksmith then He's around there somewhere. Oh, you look French. Sorry, he's racist, but he doesn't look French. Jess? Uh, good morning? Hmm. Is it though? I, well, I guess? He guesses. Wonderful. Well, perhaps you can guess that I really don't want to talk such drivel right now. Go, scurry off and leave me be. Well, isn't he a friendly fellow? Sorry, mister. You, what do you have? Hello, I don't believe I've seen you before. We just came in from the west. Ah, oh, so you're the one everyone is talking about. Everyone's talking? Of course, you're the one who saved Oneida. Uh, my name is Mosca and I am at your service. If you need anything, just let me know. Say, are you, uh, are you staying long? I don't know. Why do you ask? Well, if you ever find yourself heading east of the village, maybe you could let me know if the roads are safe? Oh, they're far from safe. The town guards mentioned that monsters have been attacking all sides of the village. You're better off staying inside the walls for now. Well, see, here's my problem. I I've been needing to visit someone in Denham. It's a small village on the edge of Abadi's forest. I imagine this someone is pretty important to you? Well, yeah. See, it's about a girl. Oh. Well, surely she's worth the danger. Oh, she is. She definitely is. I just, I, I want to make sure she's okay. With all these monsters around, there's been no word from Denim at all. Mosca, if my travels take me there, I'll let her know you're thinking about her. Oh, thank you so much. You're great. You're really, really great. Whoa. I thought I exploded, but apparently it's just not. Um, yes, materials, snacks. Ah, there we go, blah blah. Um, let's just go with fidget. Sure. Okay. So apparently we're supposed to find a random girl. Oh, chest. Yeah, you have keys. Dun 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 dun. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> Sorry. Oops. You! You're perfect! Thank you! Um, thanks? Not you! Listen, do you hear it? Can you hear its whispers locked within? Within the box. My box. What the hell? I don't hear anything. Well, of course you don't. My box has been lost. Somebody must have stolen it. Perhaps it was that Mosca fellow. He's always averting his gaze from me. 
like he's hiding something. Probably his distaste for your nuttiness. I can hear its whispers coming from below. Down, deep down in the earth. If you're ever down there, please, you must find my box and return it at once. And whatever you do, do not open the box. Okay, Reed. If I find your box underground, I'll be sure to bring it back. I don't even know what to say. That will just pretend that didn't happen. Hi there. Well, hello. Uh, uh, you're a quiet one. Dust, manners. You'll have to excuse him. He's a bit worn out, saving the village and everything, you know? Yes, I heard something about that. Ah, uh, yes. Well, good. Honestly, it doesn't matter. They'll just keep coming back. I... And there's nothing we can do about it. Excuse me. Okay, that was the box thing. Yeah, okay. Um, what is wrong with her? Can you talk to you? If no, thank you. I didn't introduce myself before. My name is Dust, and my companion here is Fidget. Hello again. Dust? Really? Is something wrong? No, I I'm sorry. It's just an interesting name. I'm Ginger. Oh, and about those people you saved. Yes? Well, that was a noble thing to do. So thank you. Oh, she can smile. Isn't she cute? Oh, you got a ring. Yep. She's a cheerful one, huh? A bit of gratitude might have been nice. What kind of a bratty... Hey, ease off, Dust. She looked like she was pretty depressed. I... I don't know why I said that. I'm sorry, Fidget. I... I don't know what came over me just then. Come on, let's keep moving. Okay. Should I go? Um... Blueprint... I have a ring! Perfect. Here. Uh, blueprint. Okay. Let's keep going. Ah, our famed savior! I had hoped you'd come. Welcome to my humble shop. Um, so. So I got some more people. Um, okay, what did you... Um, what did you... Uh, we have one of those. Okay. Thank you for coming in. I can almost guarantee your satisfaction. Almost. <laughs> almost. I'm so glad. Up. Oh. Or down. No. Oh, okay. I want to go up. Hey. Oh, hi. You're new. Are you travelers? Mm -hmm. Maybe you can help me? I can't find my little brother, Corbin. He's not in the village? No, he's not here. I can't find him, and I've looked absolutely everywhere. Don't worry, I'll keep an eye out for him. What's your name? My name is Colleen. Oh, I wonder if he left the village. He could get hurt. Calm down, Colleen. I'll look for him. Where did you see him last? I think he was doing something for Mr. Gianni, but whenever I ask him about Corbin, he says he's too busy. I really don't like that guy. Was it a French guy? Gianni, huh? Okay, wait here. If you find Corbin, please bring him home. I'm really getting worried about him. Yeah, you should be. Do I have a key? I don't have a key. Okay, let's check down. What was that? The <clears throat> save point. Perfect. Yes. Oh, there was a note. Note. Um. Oh, it's talking about the cage with the rustling and everything. The four locks. Yeah, four keys. I need. At the moment, I have zero keys. So, so, oh, the bunnies. Oh, they're so adorable. Let's go back and talk to that guy. That makes him win while we're here. But why is it raining again? It was so nice of me. 
Have you been down there? Yes, that was just Okay, uh Moscow. Where is this guy? You? Yes, you. What did you do with the boy? Gianni, I wanna ask you about a boy named Corbin. Ah, have you seen him? Where has that foolish boy run off to? I was hoping you could tell me. He must still be wasting time in Ivydale Glen. I just knew I shouldn't have trusted that boy with cleaning my fabrics. Corbin is doing your laundry outside the village? I do not see why this is so difficult to comprehend. But then I suppose you don't have the capacity for rational thought. If you are so concerned, maybe you should go look for him instead of waffling about. Oh, I'll find him. Then we're going to have a little chat. Oh, I really do not like him. What an a hole. Oh, yeah. Back to drawing. Sorry. I didn't mean to cut the neck. Oh, look. The thing's actually moved with me. That is so cool. But I'm gonna stop raining. Sweet. Okay. So there was a save point down there. There's a chest up here. That's not new. Do you remember something? No, it's just this way. No more buttons. Hey! You look important. Good day. I'm Mayor Bram. So you're the hero I've been hearing about. It's nothing, really. We're just passing through. No need to be modest, my friend. We can't thank you enough for your help. Things have been rough in Aurora of late, so having a true hero in our midst is really boosting morale. So, what's your name, son? Dust. My name is Dust. And some of the villagers I've met, they don't seem quite as pleased as you. Ah, are you talking about the Watchmen? You must understand, hardly a day goes by without some monstrosity attacking our peaceful village. They were simply being cautious. Take my word. I'm sure they meant no ill will. And there was also this girl. Yes, that could only be Ginger. She can be a bit of a handful, but don't pass judgment on her like that. You have no idea what she's gone through this past year. She looked pretty upset about something. Yes, she did. Don't concern yourself. We have other matters to discuss. What help could I possibly provide? A few giants in a field seem like the least of your problems. Yet again with the modesty. You're no mere travelers, that much I've gathered. Mineral merchants don't wield blades as impressive as yours, Dust. Please, we really could use the help. I don't know. I'm searching for something myself. Then perhaps we can help each other. If you help our village, I promise I'll do whatever I can to help you. But I can be of no assistance while our village is constantly attacked by these creatures. We suspect their leader is close by, and if you could... Whoa, 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 you hold on a second. You're saying those mindless thugs have a leader? Until recently, they would attack us in small groups. Nothing we couldn't handle. Now, they coordinate attacks on a much larger scale, hitting the village on both sides, driving our forces apart. I assure you, whatever leads these things is experienced in warfare. Great. What do they want? Our land, I imagine. Just a casual observation, but they don't seem the farming type. Well, whatever it is, it's become a serious problem. If you truly are as capable as I hear... You want us to find their leader? It certainly would cripple their advance. You'll be doing the entire village a great service. How about it, Dust? Well, I... You feel a conflict of emotions. This is good. I will abide by your decision, Master. I trust you to take the right path. Helping this village is the right thing to do. But it's more than that. It's almost like... like I know these people. Like I have to help them. I think that strange feeling you've got is a little foreign concept called compassion. <laughs> I'm proud of you, Dust. Of course, if you said no, I'd need to bite your face off. Charming as always, Fidget. I think you've made a wise decision. All right, Mayor Bram, you've convinced us. We'll do what we can to help stop these attacks. 
<laughs> That's my boy. The watchman reported increased monster activity to the east of our village, so I imagine that's where you should go. But do be careful. Strong as you may be, I've seen many fine warriors lose their lives to these monstrosities. I understand, Mayor. I'll be careful. And I'll be back. And I leveled up again. Okay. Um. Uh, okay. We need to attack. That's what we need. Okay, let's keep going. More quests. Hey, you're the outsider. Yep. Yeah, that's me. That's great. So you must know your way around out there. Maybe you could do me a favor. Depends on the favor. What is it you need? Well, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Fail, and I'm in charge of keeping our guards well equipped. Oh, so their poor equipment is pretty much your fault. <laughs> in so many words, yes. It's not like I enjoy giving them subpar equipment. If I had better materials, I could make better gear. Tell you what. If you could bring me five imp hides, I would gladly buy them off you for more than the shop will offer. I'll keep my eyes open. Much appreciated. I'll be waiting right here. Okay. Now, can we actually go? Um, um, where do we go? Hmm. This is where we're supposed to go, so let's go here first. Arches Pass, wasn't that where the... Blacksmith was? I think? Maybe? Oh, we'll see. Yes, lots of monsters. This should be fun. Okay, yeah. What's this? Go down there. Yeah, assault, trap. Okay, I don't have that apparently, so let's keep going. Something flapping. <laughs> what? Uh, that isn't you? Hey, I don't make that much noise. Wait, you're right. <laughs> Look out! We've got company. Flipping? Oh, flipping. Oh, I know what to do with you. Actually get to kill things now. Sorry for the long uh, cutscenes there, but I think it's kind of important to start, so I wanted to show it to you guys. If you're not into that, just skip ahead or something. Oh, save point. It's time. Let's just kill some more of these things and then go save, and then we'll end this episode. Mine. Whatever I did just reset everything. It did. Yeah. How did I do that? Why did I just fall down? Okay, but no, get out of there. Thank you. And get away. Okay. I'm gonna end this episode here and we'll pick it up next time and see where this archer pass leads us. I believe in voice of blacksmith. But anyway, I'll see you next time. Bye!